Dallas with a firm header away. And uh, Fortune misjudged the bounce there. Jeremy profits. Not a bad ball either. That drug was header for good. Jonsson! Brilliant! Chelsea have scored! 15 minutes into the new era. One of the old faces has given them the lead against Manchester United. Aida Gudjonsson. Mourinho has arrived and he's arrived in style. Great move, Alan. Good little interplay down the right-hand side. I think it's Jeremy has a little look up. Drogba and Gudjonsson switch. Great forward play, that is. Drogba then finds Gudjonsson just onside. Tips it just over Tim Howard and throws himself at the ball to bundle that over the line. Great combination. And there's no way Idaho Johnson's going to allow Roy Keane to get enough on that. What a start of the game. There's one happy new manager. Paul's goal smacks that one. That wasn't a bad effort from that range. You could tell by the run-up there, he was only intending ever to really, really thump that. He wasn't trying to curl that in or anything else. It's a long way out, a lot of bodies running across the front of check. Going a couple of yards wide, the goalkeeper had it covered, but it was a good hit. Trying to hit that with the outside of his boot, just trying to fade that back. He's averaged something like a goal every four games in his Manchester United career, which is a outstanding ratio, yeah. There are a few strikers quite happy with that, I think. And he's not, of course, an out-and-out -out striker by any means. And he wins it back again here, but given away in midfield. Smurty with the through ball for Drogba. It could be two. Well played, Howard. Very good work by the big American keeper. Otherwise, Manchester United were facing a two-goal deficit. Damien Duff's still not available through injury, but he's really a, a left midfielder. They've got Robin coming in as well. He's injured, but he plays down the left too. Fortune's cross was a good one, and the goalkeeper got lucky there, really. Great ball in from Quinton Fortune. Ryan Giggs gambled, very nearly got on the end of that. That's better from Manchester United, and so was Neville's cross. Clearance by Terry. Jemba Jemba picks it up, and again. Neville. In short, this time to O'Shea. Oh, they had enough bodies in the way, Chelsea. The danger still hasn't gone. Fortune, another block, a layoff. Scholes scuffed it. And as Andy said, a whole posse of bodies in the way here. Looks like it's Lampard who's going to strike it. And he found a way through all those bodies, but not into the net. Well, it wasn't one of the purest strikes I've ever seen, Frank Lampard. It goes through a little... I think it just goes through someone's legs. Tim Howard can't see a lot of that. That would have been in before he'd have even seen it. There's O'Shea for Manchester United, who are still a goal behind here. Not far short of the hour mark. Scholes. Miller. And again, space on the right. Now, how can Neville deliver this time? Not bad is the answer. Smith's header. Never a threat. Decent enough ball. Slightly over hit by Gary Neville. I would like to see United just try a little bit harder to get to the byline. When it goes to Gary Neville, I'd like to see him get on the outside. He ducks back in. Again, that makes it such a difficult one to attack for a striker. It's a decent ball, just slightly over here. Hey, Makaleli, now Lampard. No. Always looking to shoot there, Frank Lampard. Very good from that sort of distance. Once he gets beyond the opponent's, the opposition midfield and starts bursting forward there. As soon as McAlady releases him, it's a danger now. Sylvester and Roy King can't really close him down. Invite the shot. It's a poor one. Fortune. Lampard takes it clear for Chelsea. Has he got the legs? Well, he was surely tripped, wasn't he? No. Mr. Paul says no to the anger of this packed Stamford Bridge crowd. Jemba Jemba. Gary Neville. O'Shea battling to win the header. Better spell for United. But for a desperate tackle from William Gallison. From this cross, Gary Neville whips it in. 
John, jo, uh, John O'Shea just getting in front of John Terry, but never really going to beat Czech from there. Jeremy. Bumper to his right, with Janssen to his left. He's the one he picks out. Smirt in. Oh, not a bad effort. Long way up, a decent hit. Skulls. Hello, oh, Ferreira getting there, but Giggs got a foot to it. And Diego Forman straight away could score here. Just couldn't dig it out. Paolo Ferreira did very, very well, Alan. Just to get a foot in there and divert that back to check. Ferreira does well there in trying to block Giggs. Now he doesn't give it up. He gets in behind Gallas there. Gets a little foot on it. Oh, that's a great ball for Diego Forlan, who hit it first time. Great ball, as you said, and a great first touch. I think Forlan realised he had William Gallas bearing down on him. Held his, made a great run, held the line very well. Gallas bearing down on him, and the left-footed shot is wild. Miller. Little slip, but still found Forlan. The cross in the middle towards Giggs. It's great football again from United. And I'll tell you what, Ryan Giggs having got across the front of Ferreira, I think he should score. I think he knows it as well. Great link up there. Wonderful dig out from Alan Smith. And Ryan Giggs has done everything right. I think it's Gallas maybe he's got across. I think he should score there. Delivered in again, but far too close to the goalkeeper. Good throw out, Keshman. Ricardo Carvalho is the player who's got forward in support. Keshman wasn't going to have any of that. <laughs> Here it is, Carvalho. And a good shot in the end by the other new man, Keshman. Neville, Keane calling for the ball and he's giving it away. That could be very costly indeed. Two men forward, Keshman screaming for the ball. And still. Well, they've kept possession, that's all that matters. Smerdin doing well and finding Lampard in the end. <laughs> and that should be enough for Chelsea.